Hey, I wanted to show everybody something cool. I just noticed in my uh, game stuff on Guitar Bots, <clears throat> my final challenge that nobody's completed yet, except for obviously me, but it's tough. It is, but don't think that uh, it's impossible. I'm going to show you what it sounds like um, with my audio on here. Anybody could do this on the game now, and it's free for people who go on there, which is awesome. So here's what it looks like. Um, here's the Here's the really technical end part of the song. It's a really fast skipping thing. Um, here's what it sounds like at normal speed. Uh, let me back it up a little bit here. Uh, Alright, here's this end, end part at normal speed. Alright, um, now of course that's not easy to do, but if you wanted to go in your practice you could see it in slow motion and you could slow it down to half the speed. Now, a lot of times when you slow down people's playing to half speed, it's really easy to notice the mistakes, obviously, because you can hear it up and close like you're zooming in almost um, on the audio. So this is really cool. So now you can hear what I sound like when I'm slowed down doing technical parts like this. And it sounds pretty good. I thought I, I didn't think it'd be this good. But uh, here's what it is half speed. <laughs> Not too bad. That's a hard part there too. And again, this whole part at full speed, it's, it's a really tough rhythm, this section here, by the way. Um, I'll show you here. You can hear my crappy. Uh, where uh, my, I'm not sure if it's crappy or not. My sweet parps. Uh, where are they? Oh, here's a straight picking part actually. After the sweet parps, let me see because I know I had some trouble doing some of this when I wrote it. Um, let me hear it at full speed and see where I'm at. <laughs> That's a really tough part, and I'm sorry for people who are, it's going to take a little bit to get down, because it's, even for me now, going back through it, I forget the part, and relearning it feels a little bit tough. So let's go to half speed and take a listen of what this uh, is doing here, and see how off I was. If, if I was off, I'd say, you, you never know. It's, it's really tough when you're going very fast. <laughs> there is very difficult uh, not just because of speed the rhythm being used um, I'm using three different types of rhythm feels and it's really tough to blend those especially playing fast doing little string jumping parts so here it is slow
hear, actually, you can hear me along with the synth to see how close I am, because you'll definitely hear if I'm off with the MIDI. Let's see. I was a tiny bit ahead of the rhythm towards the beginning. That's pretty awesome. Let's see this one. That's really, really good. Alright, I guess I don't suck on guitar. Um, so, I, just kidding, anyway, but... Yeah, so this is really neat. You could turn on your metronome uh, if you don't want to listen to my backing. And it's built right in. Uh, you could shut off the bouncing guy if that's annoying to you. I, I like him, actually. It's, I don't like the looks of him, but I... Well, a little bit. But I like that he's there bouncing on my notes. Um, but yeah, I have a bunch of exercises and lessons built right into this now where you could go on and slow down my playing and uh, learn exactly what I'm doing. Um, and it's fun. It's actually... It's, it's a fun challenge. If you beat my game here, you get the... You get the um, reward, what is that thing called, a badge. So anyway, yeah, up to speed here at the end. With the guitar synth, why not? Oh. There we go. The guitar, the guitar synth can't keep up with my playing there. Um, Alright, so, we'll go home. I'll show you how this thing works. little demo here. Uh, as you can see, I didn't complete part two. Actually, I, I did, but they re um, did they did a re upload of the song for the game to make it for everybody for free because they wanted everybody to be able to try it instead of just paid members, which is really cool. So now I don't have my um, what do you call it my completion stat anymore, so people don't even think I can play my own song. So I'll have to go back in and do that again. Um, I went over the rhythm thing today, which was fun. I, I didn't realize they did. They have my rhythm part now. So if you wanted to just learn the rhythm part, you could practice it or play it. I'm not going to hit play, um, even though it has a cool band playing with the robot in the background and all that stuff. Um, it'll it knows I'm not playing the guitar, so it'll tell me I failed. So anyway, it shows you the chords. You can click and watch my video of me playing it too. So here's the chord part for the rhythm guys, and of course you can slow this down too. If you need it, you can go whatever speed. You can mute the song. Obviously, that doesn't help. Um, unless you have the guitar synth on and the metronome. It has every little, every little hit I've played. It's pretty cool. See the little hand up there showing you where you can play it. Again, this is just a practice mode, also, so it's a little bit different. So yeah, even if you can't do the lead stuff, you can still try to compete on the song. It's cool. And again, now it's got my actual backing I made.
it's got my awesome audio. So anyway, we'll go to the home thing. I'll show you what else. Now I have my friends on here and students, I think, all these different cool people that I, some of them I don't know that are just on the game itself. Um, that are doing the, you could do the Mr. Fast for him. He's got challenges on here as well that are really cool. Really nice songs. I, I always liked his uh, composition. Melody is awesome. Um, but yeah, it shows you where your friends are compared to each other. So you have challenges. It shows you what badges you've unlocked. And you can put them on Facebook if you wanted to or whatever social media. Um, and they have the robot badge now. I think it's the last badge you can get. Yeah, the, the final ultimate badge. If you're the ultimate guitar player, it looks like a Gear Slash Ninja Star. Robot Shredder. Unlock this badge by defeating the Robot Shredder special package prepared by the guitar virtuoso Alan Van Wert, a.k.a. Robot, I'm guessing they said. Okay, so, oops, let me close that. So that's that thing. Now if I go into Play Guitar Bots, I'll show you how, how he gets into my stuff. <laughs> All right, now you could just play their normal game. All right, you could. No, oh, I got some kind of reward. All right, so you could go into the normal game by hitting play. But if you want to go into the really cool stuff, I think it's the really cool stuff with me and Mr. Fast Finger. You go to specials. I don't know if I showed you that. Let's go back. I'll show you down here. Yeah, you can see it's specials. Uh, you could go to my robot shredder stuff, or they have fast fingers, rhythm, lead, pentatonic stuff, Irish. These are different packages by them as well. But um, so I guess me and Mr. Fast Finger have three of them on here. Uh, you could do. It's really really fun. Honestly, I don't like uh, BS. As people know, I'm pretty. I keep it real, and that upsets a lot of people. But I really like this. It's. I actually sat here and played it a lot of different times. Like I played over different. Um, exercises and things and that's the other deal on here this is just my song package where you try to play my deal right but um, if you go to let me see is it this song challenges you'll get different anybody can upload songs um, so you, you could do like the basic MIDI versions basically it's almost like um, uh, what do you call it? you upload a guitar pro I think it's called tab uh, and then it just converts it for you. It's not going to be the exact same sound quality as what I have on this special package because it'll just do MIDI, but it actually sounds really good. Maybe I can show you an example of one of mine. Uh, let me see, my song packs. These are all my exercises. As you can see, there's a lot of them on here. Um, here's one. Here's an attack. Oh, well, I can't grab that now because I have to change my screen size and then I'll mess up my camera. So, anyway, we got... Uh, yeah, my, ro my robot tapping lick is on here. Alright, that's that deal. Let me pick one here. Diatonic 7th Arpeggios Part 2. Let's go to this one. I guess 13 people have tried it already. It looks like they're all failing. We're going to find out. But we'll go to practice. And this will show you how to... This is what it's like in my exercises. It's not like backing quality audio or anything like that. It's just straight up MIDI, but... It's not bad. Now, you want to turn on the guitar sense so you can see what I'm... Now you can hear along with what you're supposed to be playing. Now if you slow it down, it makes it a lot easier so you can learn how to play my stuff and my exercises that everybody loves. A lot of them are in here. Um, so I guess that's enough of that. Uh, again, they have a lot of people's cool songs and you could even, if you go on here, you could actually upload your own exercises for you to practice. Slow them down, you could see where you're messing up at the end, it gives you a review or a summary of how well you did. Um, it's just like the, the standard games with the charts that will show how many perfect hits you had if your timing in general is behind or ahead of the beat. Uh, all that cool stuff. It's it's definitely worth checking out if you haven't yet. Uh, especially even if you have before, get back on there because now you can play um, my song stuff for free. With high quality audio, with my actual backings, you could slow it down. You could do my rhythm parts now too, and I have a little warm up in between for an extra added challenge. It's not a really tough one, um, but it'll get your hands moving and ready to do the actual lead parts to some degree. If you didn't uh, go through all the exercises, of course, which you should. But all right, people, uh, check it out. Do cool stuff, and uh, let me know whenever you get that robot badge, and I'll show everybody on my pages, and I'll be excited. <laughs>